Good solves count no matter what. Well, even though I dropped my cube, I guess, yeah, I guess it's a PB. Spends outrageous amounts of time lubing cubes. Ugh, my cube is getting so slow. Well, I guess it looks like it's time to spend a whole nother 24 hours rebuilding, relubing, and setting this thing up. Spends outrageous amounts of time researching. Hmm. Spent about two hours and, well, I'm down to five lubes left here. I still don't know what to use to set this up exactly to how I need it to be, but nothing a little more research won't hurt. I can't pause a solve. Come to your laundry. No, Mom, I can't stop my time. I'm literally mid-solve. Right now or you're grounded. <sighs> Fine, okay. Brings a cube to anything. Gosh, another social event this week? I guess I'm just gonna bring my GAN, just in case. Yeah, I think this will fit well in my pocket. We'll see. Too bad they don't make cubes more flat. Defends the cube. What do you mean it's just a toy? This is a finely tuned speed machine. You just wouldn't get it. This is literally innovation. Schedules everything. All right, so I just finished this week's schedule. Monday, we're gonna work on the GAN 13, then the RS3M Super, Wednesday, Moyu Osu, Thursday, RS3M V5, Friday, GAN 14, Saturday, 11M Pro, Sunday, Wave Rider V1, and then finally, all my cubes will have been rebuilt, relubricated, and fixed up for the coming week. Then we'll just repeat this list. If it's a Moyu, we have to have it. My new RS3M V5 just came in the mail, and Moyu already released another cube. Man, by the time I order it, they're already gonna have another one out, but I can't stop myself. I need that cube. Doesn't realize how much money was spent. So I've roughly spent $100 on cubes a week, times 52 weeks in a year, times I've been cubing for 10 years. Holy crap, I've spent $52,000 on Rubik's cubes? Oh my gosh. I swear, just one more solve. I'm literally so sick of this math homework, but I guess just one more solve and then I'll do my homework finally. 24 hours later. Yep, just one more solve. Wait, I've got school in 10 minutes. I didn't even do my homework. Forcing friends to learn. So this is my friend Justin's cube. He doesn't know how to solve this, but all he knows how to do is the, uh, yeah, that move. I can't say that name, but he doesn't know how to solve a cube. So maybe by me scrambling this whole thing up, maybe he'll learn how to finally solve it. Now I've got to go sneakily put this back on his desk. Shh. Making people record. Hey, I'm about to solve my 10 by 10. Can you record my solve? I think it's about to be a PB. It might take, well, a few minutes, yeah. OCD to the max. Well, guys, I finally did it. I spent the last four months alphabetizing my cube collection. I can't wait to start solving these in order. Cubing over anything. So my friend's having a birthday today, or I can go to the competition just down the street. I don't know. I want to be there for him, but also a cube competition. I just got this new RS3M Super. I've got to break her in. All right, I'm going to the competition. I can solve anything, I swear. So I just scrambled this thing up, and I honestly have no clue how to solve it. Uh, there's other people in the room, so I think I'm just going to keep trying to work on this and just tell them it's almost done. I can't admit that I can't solve this. Man. No one needs to know how dumb I am. Naming kids after cubing? Well, in honor of this thing, I think I'm going to name my future child Erno. Or Rubik or something. Or maybe, maybe Moyu? Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to name him Moyu. Won't work on the cross? I am literally so good at solving everything on the cube, except the cross. I could literally be sub five if I just sat down 
and learned how to solve the cross a little bit better. But luckily, I guess I'm too proud to just sit down and learn like the first step of the Rubik's Cube again. Yeah, I will never work on the cross. I guess I will never be sub five. <laughs> Efficiency is everything. So I've just watched about 10 finger trick tutorials and I'm trying to figure out how to solve the cube more efficiently. Um, after all those tutorials and about 37 hours of practice, I successfully cut 0.1 seconds off my time, but I don't feel like that's enough. Maybe I'll try this for another 50 hours and see how good I get. Cubes need to be perfect. You gotta get it just right for the optimal performance. All right, let's try that out. Crap, I think I put too much in. Um, I'm gonna have to take this whole thing apart again and re-lube in tension. Yeah, just give me another three or four hours here. No algorithm spoilers. Now, I don't wanna hear any algorithm spoilers before I figure it out myself. It's why I haven't looked up any cheat sheets yet for PLL or OLL. I really wanna learn them myself and come up with the most efficient thing I can. With that being said, does anyone have any tips to, uh, to solve this case? Brings Maine literally anywhere. My buddy just gave me this cube to uh, test how fast I am at the Rubik's Cube, but honestly, he can take that back. I literally brought my main just for this kind of circumstance. All right, mess her up, let's do it. It's a game changer. This new cube is literally a game changer for my solve times. I have gotten my average of 100 down 0 .02 seconds this month. Isn't that crazy? Man, this thing is just so innovative. Being the fastest at random puzzles. One day, I'm gonna be Felix Zemdigs, but of the banana cube. Just look how fast my turns per second are. Yeah, I bet he couldn't do that. I'm gonna be fastest in the world at this thing. Your cube is dry. Dude, your cube is literally so dry and the tensions are super uneven. Let me fix that for you really quick. Lube your cube, man, come on. What do you mean you've never lubed or tensioned your cube? Give me that, I wanna take it apart. I can make it so much better. Won't practice big cubes? Well, I'm gonna mix up my 10 by 10. I'm probably gonna become really unmotivated and then well, this thing's just gonna sit on my shelf for the next three months, and I'm gonna go back to solving two by two and three by three. But for now, solving big cubes sounds like a really good idea. All right, let's mix this thing up. Here, learn how to solve this. Dude, I'm telling you, if you actually learn how to solve the Rubik's Cube, you will get so many more ladies, dude. You'll become smarter at your math, smarter at science. I mean, there's no downside to learning the Rubik's Cube. Here, take this for the night. I like to collect, what can I say? I've got about 150 puzzles in my collection, but I'm not done collecting yet. I know you can really only solve one at a time, and there's no reason to have, well, 45 3x3 three three speed cubes, but I just like collecting them. Cubes must go in the bags. Well, I've been going really hard with this Rubik's Cube for like three hours, but we gotta keep it in this bag to keep it nice, even though I threw it down every time I was done with my solve. I don't know. Let's keep her nice.